bat. Um, what was your intent there with that pitch? Uh, to go inside. You know, obviously I've left the ball over the plate a couple of times to him, and he's taken advantage of that. So just mostly go inside, and obviously I got it in a little bit too far. Did you know as soon as you hit him that he might be coming after you? I didn't know, and, uh, you know, I didn't expect that. Um, you know, but it's part of the game, and he that's what he decided to do. You understand, given what happened three years ago, kind of the optics of what people will think happened? Yeah, I can see. I can see how that kind of stands in people's minds. Um, you know, but that's that's the past. Um, you know, like I said, I left the ball over the plate uh, a couple of times to him. He's taking advantage of that. So, you know, obviously I'd rather miss in than over the plate. What are your instincts? What kicks in when you see him coming after you with the helmet in his hand like that? It's go time. I mean, it's just you got to protect yourself and stand your own ground, you know. You expecting you get something from the league here? Out of all this. Um, I, you know, I, I'm not sure how all that goes. Um, you know, that's their decision, and you know, obviously, I'll take whatever consequences come with it. And I just, you know, we'll go from there. It took a few players to, to get you off the field. Is that just the adrenaline? Uh, yeah, I mean, I was pretty fired up to be honest with you. Um, you know, but that's just adrenaline, and, and you know, it's part of the game. wasn't an intentional pitch, would you say something to him or apologize or anything like that? Or is that uh, I think we'll just, you know, kind of leave it as it is. And then, you know, if, if need be, then we'll just go from there. But, you know, as of right now, we're just kind of 